May we never be a disgrace to our children in Jesus' name. Amen. May we not bring disgrace to our family members. So, guys, may we not see what you don't do himself. How you by himself using hand, go market, go buy bad market. May we not see how you don't do children. All his family members don't they deny him publicly for social media because of another man's wife when he go knock. May we not see how Judy Austin has brought disgrace to himself. My people, not be small thing. This Mr. Obasi case, now you'll a uh, biggest nightmare. You'll be no no say Mr. Obasi go take legal action. Or he go see people when he go support him, the way Nigerians turn up for him. To the extent, they go open GoFundMe account for Mr. Obasi Emmanuel. The ex-husband to Judy Austin. Guys, not be small thing, no. Why Mr. Abbas's case will be your Edoche biggest nightmare? Now I want to tell now for this video, as Mr. Emeka, the founder of a DPA organization. If you don't know, DPA now the foremost justice movement in Africa at large. They caters for the interest of members and society. It's all about justice, equality, and fairness for all. That they seek, that they fight for justice. For people when be say they not get voice. So according to Mr. Emeka, is also one of the legal uh, practitioner to me a doche matter. Is an advocate. He let us know say this case of Mr. Obasi Emmanuel go become your Edoche's biggest nightmare and problem. According to him, it is clear that neither Yol Edoche nor Judy Austin expected to hear from Mr. Obasi Emmanuel again. Like I said, they never thought that Obasi will come out to seek for uh, public uh, support. They never thought that he will take a legal action to fight for the custody of his children. After they don't threaten Mr. Obasi Emmanuel, the last time he came out through Jis Lover, Judy and Yol Edoche thought they have silenced him forever. They never expected to hear from Mr. Obasi Emmanuel again. They must have considered him a dead case or a close fire. After 10 years, during which Obasi was beaten into the ground, they must have seen him as a finished story. <laughs> it's, but it seems that the person they had considered dead has re resurrected to seek justice, and they are not prepared for it at all. By the way, Obasi's lawyer, have made it clear that if Obasi is threatened in any way again, they will respond decisively and with overwhelming measures. Without trying to prompt them, it is clear to me that they understood the challenges they face and have taken promptive measures to protect their clients. Why is Obasi a nightmare to Yul? All this why Yul and Judy had relied on the culture and sentiment of the Igbos which tolerate polygamy. For most Nigerian men, especially Igbo men, the idea of a man marrying more than one wife is normal and welcome. So guys, according to uh, Mr. Obasi, legal team, say Yol Edoche believes before say because he's an Igbo man, he's entitled to marry many wives, like he's normal marrying more than one wife, as far he can cater for them. But y'all can't forget, say, he was not married to me Edoche alone traditionally, but he was also married to her under the statutory law as well, like they did court wedding. So for that reason, you'll not even get anything to do with polygamy. If his first wife not permit him, if his first wife not give him the go ahead, you'll not go try him under law. That is why... Court marriage, like customary marriage and the traditional marriage, they date different. When you are married under the statutory law, you have to obey the law. You all, a doche, still forget, say, Judy Austin, now married woman. A married woman, when they put money for her head. So, according to Igbo tradition, now, alu, abomination. So, for the fact that you all, a doche, don't put himself for the biggest nightmare and problem of his lifetime, which he don't finally even ruin a career. When when you think of saying won't enter politics, make it just common mind because this matter, this involvement with another man's wife, 
don't even fair ruin a political career. You will not get where they go for there at all. And for the shame he brought upon himself and family. Now make can I first start this video with make us may God not let us bring disgrace to our family. Mm, if you get family member when the disgrace for social media, you don't know what thing God do for you. Yo, eh, don't you don't make the biggest mistake of his life, like of his entire life on earth. Because I don't know how you go take build back a reputation. How you go take build back that name when it already be made for himself. Like, eh? People say this and the real definition of last born way not get sense. And also lie on the born goats. Because if you see where your Edoche they come from, they the foundation where it come from, the Edoche's family, they be get sense. When I mean sense, they are very well respected. Reputable uh, family, now your Edoche come from. But unfortunate, you can't involve himself with this. Imagine dragging you, your matter, your name, they for headlines. For social media, on top another man, wife, another man, they drag you, they go court because of your wife. <laughs> My people, Judy Austin, now he put you a doche for this problem. It's unfortunate, not not be all women, men supposed to involve themselves with. Yes, I'm a woman, but there are a lot of daughters of Jezebel out there. When they mean no good to you, but not to con ruin your life, to con ruin your career, to con ruin everything you have built for years. Mr. Obasi, man, we need justice. He's not asking for too much. Mr. Obasi is not asking for too much. All he wants now shared custody of his children. Yes, for over 10 years, according to him, Judy and Yol Edoch never let him see his children. That was why he cried out on social media because now social media may be the new life these days. Oh. Yes, and thank God they turn up for him. Mr. Obasi don't take lawyer. He don't go the fight and the legal way. And now, Mr. Emeka, the founder of DPA organization, don't let us know, say, this case, like this Mr. Obasi case, go be your Edoche biggest nightmare because he just got himself into a big problem. A problem that has ruined his reputation. A problem that has ruined his career, his family. And yourself is not even happy about it. Yol is not happy about it at all. The way he named the trend for negative reason for social media. The annoying part for all this matter be said, Judy Osti is not even living with these children. She go drop them for village, for Umoji, in the Mili local government area. Constantly they deprive their father not getting access to them, like no communication whatsoever. Judy is heartless. She is evil. But time, see what she put Yol Edoche. He don't finally land Yol. A doche to the biggest problem of his lifetime. Guys, I go like make we hear from the horse's mouth. Make we hear from Mr. Emeka. Judy Austin S. husband, Mr. Obasi, legal team. His legal practitioner. When one help and fight this case against you, a doche. You don't enter big thing, oh, big problem. For this life, just pray. Then you don't use your hand. Take by yourself. Guys, make we watch the video. Before then, this now Bazi News. Hit on the follow button, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and remember to put up the post notification bell. Let's go there, guys. This is Mr. Emmanuel Obasi. I had the opportunity of meeting him today to discuss his uh, matter. We've had a very extensive discussion, which confirms some of the initial impressions we had. This is a man who had come to the DPA to ask for help so he could have access to his children. Whom had, from whom he had been separated for the past 10 years. He explained to us very intricate set of facts, and we have decided to help him in the way we could. But it is important for us to clarify at this moment. BPA itself will not, again, BPA itself will not be taking on this case. However, we believe that like any other citizen of this country, Mr. Bassi desires justice. So we have decided to refer him to another lawyer in an ambassador, a very competent and capable lawyer, whom we believe will do an excellent job in protecting the rights of this man and providing him uh, effective representation. And uh, again, I must emphasize, BPA will not take the case of Mr. Obasi, and the reason is because we are involved in another case, which has some relationship with this case. 
we want to leave no doubt in the minds of the people that uh, Queen May is not sharing the lawyer with Mr. Bashi. We also want to emphasize that Queen May has no involvement in Obasi's case, and uh, her lawyers are not Obasi's lawyers. It's very important to know this. And the reason is obvious. Uh, the two cases are different. Even though they may have a common opponent in these cases, the case of Queen May is totally different from the case of Obasi. The laws involved are different. The procedures involved are different. The cost is different. Therefore, they cannot share a lawyer, and that's why DPA is not coming in, in for Mr. Bashi directly. However, we've done all we could by transferring him to another lawyer in Ananda State. And Mr. Bashi today has met the new lawyer, and uh, they are going to be talking, they are going to be getting to the details of it. We shall be on the sideline watching and hoping that Mr. Bashi will have ju ju justice. At the end of the day, we are certain he will have justice. We are very confident of that, given the peculiar nature of his case and the pain and suffering he has endured over the past 10 years. So, it was quite touching to meet him today and to witness again the intense emotions behind what he has endured. Okay? Thank you. But again, for those listening, because we have seen it repeated on social media several times, that uh, the men's legal team are taking over the case of Obashi. That's not true. They are not taking over the case, but we support him, and we hope that he will get justice. And um, his lawyers are very good, and very sure of that. In fact, uh, Obashi, as we told him today, he has so much to, so much to be happy about. There is now hope in, um, for the past 10 years, he has been in a very dark, and difficult situation, losing total access to his children, but that will begin to change. Okay? Thank you, Mr. Bassett, and thank, thank you for coming. You. Everything is going to be all right. And uh, hopefully, we'll have justice someday, very soon. Okay? And you'll be reunited with your children. Okay? Thank you so much. Again, nice to see you.